Solomon Liu is basically Melbourne's Mr. Retail. He's been absolutely absorbed by the retail sector ever since he was a young fellow in the rag trade in the back lanes of Flinders Lane in Melbourne, churning out women's fashions, trying to sell it into retail stores, into department stores. And for him, the shining light on the hill, the big house on the hill, was the Meyer Emporium. This was the centre of retail power in Melbourne. And he got his chance in the early 80s to buy into Meyer at a very low price, and he essentially saved the company when it was in when it hit, hit rocky waters. And the family were very grateful to him for that. And he built that into a major stake in the Coles Meyer Group after Meyer and Coles, the other great retail uh, arm in the empire out of Melbourne, merged in the late 80s. So he was fundamentally always interested in retail. He's also interested very much on the manufacturing and import side of fashion. So the two things come together in terms of bringing product into the country, producing it when it was pr being produced in, a, in factories in, in Australia, and then selling it through retail stores. So when you look at his interest in David Jones, he obviously had this long-term relationship with the Meyer Emporium, with the Coles, Coles Meyer Group. He was ejected from the board uh, back in the late 90s, um, and he probably doesn't feel very happy about that, obviously, but he ended up making his fortune when he sold his, his significant stake in the, in the Coles Meyer Group uh, to West Farmers in the, just before the GFC and pocketed around about a billion dollars. So that's the foundation of his fortune, but he's still intensely interested in retail. So why come back to David Jones? Well, department store retailing is still a very, very big chunk of the retail market. And it's in ferment with the arrival of all sorts of foreign chains coming to Australia like Zara and Uniglo. But there's obviously great opportunity there to remake the department store retailing and to take it into a new era and to marry it with the online space. Billions of dollars of your money goes through department stores still, but it's in a state of ferment and it provides huge opportunity for someone like Solomon Liu who is so intensely focused on retail to develop in some way and to see opportunity basically to make money.